I'm John Stone, I'm the manager of Dean City Farm. The farm's a really vital asset to the local community and it's about more than just looking after the animals. It's about all of the other things that we do for the community through people's passion and enjoyment of working with animals. Our farm is about five acres in size. Um, we've been on this current site for about 20 years. We've been around in existence for about 35 years. Um, and on this site we've got cows, pigs, goats, alpacas, ferrets, well, you name it, we've got it more or less. We have about 12 horses and ponies uh, and we do lessons in the weekends and evenings. Uh, we have about, I think, 170 people come right here a week. We also run our education programme, we've got a full-time education coordinator and she coordinates all of our educational activities. Um, so we have lots of schools coming here on tours and we have incubators that go out to local schools with eggs that then they hatch into little chicks and that helps the children understand on a real, real understanding of where the chicken comes from. Discover the Farm is booked and arranged through Merton Council. So that is more arts and crafts based focus, so that tries to work arts and crafts in with the farm. So we try and work sort of doing lots of art, hands-on activities and try and link that really closely to the farm. Dean City Farm is a fantastic place for volunteers to come and learn great skills about working with animals, horticulture uh, or working with the horses. By my estimations we are probably the biggest uh, city farm volunteer programme in London, maybe Britain, possibly the world. So as a charity we're heavily reliant upon donations to keep us open and keep us running, delivering the services to the community. Um, so it's both both people coming in and putting their one pound in the donation box for their you know, walk around. But it's also about the bigger donations that we get from, um, from local businesses and from local grant making bodies that we're applying to.